McClellan's theory of needs. David McClellan proposed that an individual's specific needs are acquired over time and are shaped by one's life experience. Most of these needs can be classed as achievement, affiliation, or power. A person's motivation and effectiveness in certain job functions are influenced by these three needs. People with a high need for achievement seek to excel and thus tend to avoid both low-risk and high-risk situations. Achievers avoid low-risk situations because the easily attained success is not a genuine achievement. In high-risk projects, achievers see the outcome as one of chance rather than one's own effort. High achiever individuals prefer work that has a moderate probability of success, ideally a 50% chance. They prefer either to work alone or with other high achievers. A person's need for power can be one of two types, personal and institutional. Managers with a high need for institutional power tend to be more effective than those with a high need for personal power. Those who need personal power want to direct others, and this need often is perceived as undesirable. Persons who need institutional power, also known as social power, want to organize the efforts of others to further the goals of the organization. Those with high need for affiliation need harmonious relationships with other people and need to feel accepted by other people. The affiliation driver produces motivation and need to be liked and held in popular regard. They perform well in customer service and client interaction situations. The reward system is used to motivate employees. It can be divided into monetary or non-monetary. The organization that applies McClellan theory, money is not main motivator for their employees. Instead non-monetary rewards are more important. Employees with high need for achievement, feedback, recognition, and praise is more valuable. Employees with high affiliation, they are motivated when being praised personally by their superior. People with high need for power, they prefer reward in term of career development opportunities. People with different needs are motivated differently. Managers need to be capable of identifying individual needs and how they should motivate each individual. For employees with high need for achievement, managers should give them an opportunities to handle challenging project. However, employees with high affiliation need perform best in a cooperative environment. Normally, people with high affiliation perform well in dealing with clients. Different with employees with high need for power, management should provide power seekers the opportunity to manage others. In a modern world, McClellan theory is still applicable. First, need for achievement is become more challenging but realistic project. Employees with high achievers must be grouped together to achieve company goals. Employees needs constant feedback for improve their works. Next, need for affiliation is applicable in modern world because employees mostly perform better in groups, friendly and cooperative environment. They do not like to take on challenging tasks but prefer manageable tasks. They prefer personal feedback rather than constructive feedback. Last but not least, need for power. It provided leadership roles whenever possible for individuals. Employees are more competitive and prefer created using Powtoon.